Hey guys, welcome back to Colts Gaming. And in today's video, guys, we are back. Where it all started, our first video on the channel, Plants vs. Zombies, guys. And we're doing another tutorial today, guys. And it's going to be on another mini game, and it's going to teach you how to win it every time. So, the mini game we're doing today, guys, is Last Stand. If you guys don't know what Last Stand is, you start off with 5,000 sun. You get to pick anything you want here and you set up your whole defense area and you have to survive for five flags now at the end of each flag when you survive you get about i think 250 sun so you get to replace some things that maybe got eaten or damaged so i'm just going to teach you what to pick to win all the time so the first thing i like to pick guys which gets me to win is the watermelons for 300 sun they're they're really going to save your life here and then you're going to want to pick the big walnuts they will also save your life lily pads for the water you are going to want to get then these are big lifesaver magnets but they don't work in the sun so you're going to need some cocoa beans as well to wake them up but these magnets guys they are so helpful like they will take the helmets off the nfl zombies the doors off the zombies the helmets off the zombies so they're really handy so make sure you pick magnets that's what i realized when i kept losing i was like what can i do differently and I use the magnets and I started winning every time. So the magnets are a big thing. Then you're going to want to get these things for the water. They're only 25 sun, so it's not too bad. You're going to want to get the ice ones. The, what are they called? Snow? Snow pen? <laughs> I think that's what it's called. So you're going to want to get that. So down the zombies. Really handy. You're going to want to get these as well. They shoot butter, which slows down the zombies. You can get the 100 watermelons as well and then you can kind of just get whatever you want really now because they're all the main things yeah so you have one slot free so what i usually like to do is just get the mini walnuts just in case we don't have enough and i'm like oh i need some protection so the walnuts are good so here's the layout you want to do so at the back you're going to want to do the 300 watermelons and make sure you do them on the water as well and then you're going to want to come down about to here i think and you want to place the big walnuts and make sure you do that on the water as well. Then you're going to want to do the snow pen ones here. I forgot what they were called. There. Magnets here. So we're going to want to do two on each side. And make sure you put the co coffee beans, I think it is. Cocoa beans. Don't really know what they are. <laughs> One of them on them to wake them up. Okay, so our four magnets are awake. Now we have 950 sun left. So then you're going to want to get the butter ones and you're going to want to put them at the back as well. So have a row of them. And then you only have 300 left so you can't really do the slow down ones here. So what you want to do is get these and do four of these and then you're left with 200 sun. And we're just going to hop right into this and you will see how you're going to survive. Right guys, so we successfully defended one flag and we rewarded about 250 sun, I think it was. So now if we want, we can do the slow ones here. So I'm gonna put that one there and then one here. And we're left with 50, so we're just gonna replace this. And you guys saw how the magnets came in handy. They were taking the helmets off all the zombies, doors and all that. So they were quite handy. So we have a nice little setup now. So we're just gonna do the next flag and then see how much sun we get at the end of that and we'll see what we need to be replaced.
so we have successfully defended two flags now so what i like to do is see if any walnuts really need to be replaced these ones are looking a bit damaged but i don't think they're like needing to be replaced just yet so we have 275 suns so i suppose what you could do if you wanted you could do an extra magnet on one side and wake that up because we don't have enough for a magnet and a I think it's a cocoa bean or a coffee bean. I'm not too sure which it is, but for the bean, we don't have enough for the magnet and the bean. So we're just gonna place a magnet over there and they don't need to be replaced. Like our wallets are doing okay. So we can just hop onto the next flag and then we get more sun, see if anything needs to be replaced and then try add another magnet there because they definitely come in handy. So we're just gonna hop into the next flag and you're going to defend it. So we successfully defended three flags now guys. We're nearly there, two more flags to go. And um, the walnuts are actually looking pretty fine. They don't need to be replaced. So what I do is, hmm, another magnet. Oh my God, I didn't even place the magnet. Another magnet, put the little bean on top of that. So we have 175 left. Uh, place these, so that brings us down to 125. Hmm, do you know what? Little walnuts. Place them over there. Um, yes, yeah, so that side's pretty protected. So, yeah, let's just hop into the next flag. Right guys, we are on to the last flag now. Now our walnuts have been damaged a bit. This guy over here, he needs to be replaced. There's no even like talking about it. He is crying, he is gonna break. So we're gonna replace him. Um, oh God. Oh God, okay. Um, place this. Put a baby walnut there. Yeah, I think we're good. I think this is a pretty good setup. And this should get you through your last flag. So let's hop into it.
well that last flag was kind of difficult <laughs> it kind of makes you think like oh i'm gonna fail and then you just somehow to get like get through it so guys that has been another tutorial on how to win a mini game plants vs zombies if you guys do like these videos on plants vs zombies or even like me to see like play the adventure please be sure to let me know down in the comments i'm sure to hit that like button because it lets me know if you guys enjoy these type of videos if you enjoy the videos all but yeah guys so i hope you enjoyed this video if you did you know what to do hit that like button subscribe and i will see you in the next video